sweet people it's like a bittersweet moment because today is my last day here in Rwanda I don't know if you can see me my light is bad I just I'm going to breakfast today I woke up late I was like ah let me just sleep because I'm going to have like an evening flight I'm leaving at 1 1 a.m. so I was like let me just sleep a little bit and prepare I'm now going to breakfast and then go to the venue oh I'm so tired but I'm so grateful at the same time
satisfying anymore Ain't it true that the veil was torn? I don't need no stained glass To be washed in his blood I don't need no perfect Put together pretty words To be enough No, I want Jesus And his real love Something that I crave deep inside I've already said goodbye. Uh, generally, it was an amazing time. We learned a lot. I learned a lot, and um, I can't wait to be back again. Which I think it's gonna happen soon. I don't know, but I cannot wait to be back again to just enjoy this beautiful country. I think I should post a video about things that you should know about Rwanda. Or like top tips about Rwanda since I've been here for three days I've learned a word I've learned one or two things and
from Ghana. Nine. From Ghana. I was about to say Nigeria. Oh no. From Ghana, but they are now neighbors. Mm -hmm. Nigerians are our neighbors. Okay. Then there are a lot of other people here. Mm. That's Trevor. You've met him, I think. Uh, it's not coming out. There's Trevor. It's just the whole group is here. We're just waiting for Trevor. <laughs> so I'm not <laughs> I know it's about what he's already done, not about what I think that I gotta do. I don't need no stainless to be washed in his blood. I don't need no perfect put together. Stay